Hello! Uh, today I have a, another story for Cuatro Minuti con Casanova. I'm in kind of a particular spot here, just uh, near uh, Piazza San Marco. Behind me, this building uh, used to be the Painting Academy. Um, you know, this was a long time ago in the 1700s. And there's a, a very brief but kind of a particular story about Casanova's connection to this location. Um, the Painting Academy was a place where uh, painters would sit and paint, of course, uh, that's obvious, but uh, people would actually come as entertainment to watch the painters paint. Now, it was not only about watching artists at their work, sometimes the painters used models who were undressed, partially undressed or nude completely, and so it became actually quite fashionable for people, the wealthier nobility, to come here with their dates, you know, men and women would come together. It was quite titillating to uh, come watch the painters when really they just wanted to ogle the half-naked bodies. So uh, later in Casanova's life, he uh, had been exiled from Venice, he eventually came back, and uh, he needed money, so he started working for the Inquisition as a spy. Um, he wasn't actually the best spy. Um, in some ways he was good because he kind of knew where there was illegal stuff going on because he used to partake in this himself. But a lot of those people were his friends, so he didn't especially want to get his friends in trouble. Well, we have some records of him writing about this location, the Painting Academy, telling how people would come here to ogle the nude uh, models. And uh, we have these records in the state archives. Casanova actually used a, a pseudonym, the name Antonio Pratolino. So that it's not usually his signature, but this other pseudonym on there. Uh, he didn't actually remain a spy for very long. The inquisitors kind of said, you know, your, your uh, records are kind of vague. You don't do a very good job. You don't seem very enthusiastic about this. So they actually gave him the boot. But uh, this is a spot that a lot of people just walk by and never even know that there used to be painters with nude models and that Casanova wrote about it. So that's your story for today.